How's it going guys? So I went out with a couple of friends today. Um, did a ride, some exploring. A um, little of everything really today. Uh, checked out some back mars, some open water. And um, you know, caught a few fish. Uh, a couple of good, couple of friends that I went out with is uh, the, uh, the fish whisperer himself. <laughs> Justin Coglin, Clean Fun Fishing. Uh, if you don't know who he is, you need to check out his video, uh, Clean Fun Fishing, and um, uh, Magic, I mean uh, Metal Mike, uh, Mike from Metal Mike Fishing. Uh, we all went out, got got Mike out in a kayak, and and uh, and uh, he didn't fall in. <laughs> no man, he he uh, he's already a pro at it. He's. Uh, uh, looking to do some more some more kayak fishing soon and um, enjoy the video let's go fishing Oh, there it is. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's a little one now. And this, he's just playing, playing possum. Oop. It's just barely though. Well, I say that. I don't doubt you anymore on that shit, dude. <laughs> You're like a... Dude, that's gonna be close. I don't know yet. It's pretty. I don't think I'm gonna keep him either way. He's too small. Let's see. Let's see. I know your your eyes are so good at this. Oh. It was meant to be, it was meant to be, it's all right. He, Justin said he was slot, he must have been slot. There it is. Now that one's bigger. I say it's bigger. Oh yeah, no, that's a little bigger. Not much, but it's a little, a little bigger. Oh yeah. I saw him backtrack after I went by him.
Tell you what, guys, when some man, look at that. I guess I'm glad that happened because it would have been my finger. Ripped the, the split ring and took the hook. If it didn't do that, it would jam this in my freaking thumb. <laughs> Dude, I was wondering if that if you could if that was gonna happen or not. Uh that's probably not slot. <laughs> but it looks good. There you go, buddy. So I guess this is actually, I didn't even think about it till just now, but I guess this is actually a good time to, to show some, uh, some different retrieves. Okay, so what I got here, just a, uh, it's fairly shallow here and then there is some drop offs. This is a three and a half inch paddle tail. It's a deadly, deadly paddle tail. And I have it on a, a, I believe it's a, I believe it's an owner twist lock hook. Um, I could be, I could be wrong on the, on the brand, but, um, which I think I probably am, but, uh, uh, and you know what? I take that back. I think it's a Kelly Wiggler twist lock. So once you, once you're, once you're set on that, so you have different ways. Um, I typically will do a twitch twitch pause uh, if you've seen my um, corky same kind of thing now the difference being is this will allow you to bump it off the bottom so it's gonna it's gonna be you ever heard of a mud minnow uh, that's basically what mud minnows do is they they dig into the into the mud so you're gonna just kind of twitch it off the bottom let it stop, twitch, twitch, pause, reel in the slack, twitch, twitch, pause, reel in the slack. Sometimes you can let it sit a little longer, make sure it's on the bottom, twitch, twitch, pause, twitch, twitch, pause, reel in the slack, twitch, twitch, pause, reel in the slack. Okay? Twitch, twitch, pause, reel in the slack. Sorry, I wasn't, I was looking at the water. Let's do this again. Give it a second. It's pretty shallow here. Twitch, twitch, pause. Give it a and reel in the slack. Okay. Twitch, twitch, pause. Reel in the slack. Now, after that, you could actually just reel it in just a little bit. A straight, a straight retrieve is what they call it. Okay. And then a twitch. Reel it in twitch so there's there's different ways and as you're doing that feel it okay feel the feel the bottom feel as it hits the bottom you know it hit the bottom twitch twitch pause so you're you're bouncing it off the ground okay twitch twitch pause and then it goes back down twitch twitch pause reel in the slack goes back down feel it thump on the bottom okay feel the little as it goes through the weeds or the grass or whatever it may be uh, that's why I use the uh, weedless setup but twitch twist pause now what you're gonna feel if a fish hits it besides just taking your taking your your lure your rod out of your hand basically it's going to feel like if you were to hold, if you're holding onto your reel, I mean your rod, if you have somebody flick the rod, that's what the bite feels like. That's what a, a, an actual good strike feels like. When you feel that, go ahead and set the hook. It's just going to be a quick, like somebody went, 
in your hand. Somebody, if you're not sure, have somebody do that. And that's how it feels, whether it be a big one or small one. That was pretty, yeah, I felt the little one, but it's like a little thump. Oh! <laughs> Poor thing, I feel bad. <laughs> I felt I felt the thing. I felt the uh, <laughs> I felt the uh a pine poor thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so cute. Whee! <laughs>